Hi everyone, hope all of you are doing good. As usual, today also we are dealing with a mammal but not a land mammal. Today's our subject is a marine mammal, the orca, generally known as the killer whales. Even though they are known as the killer whales, they are not any whales anymore. They are the largest members of the dolphins and they are the strongest jawed members existing in the animal kingdom. Even though it's not yet possible to calculate the bite force of an orca mechanically, according to a scientific calculation, it's estimated that an orca is having a bite force of 20,000 pounds per square inch and that's the greatest of the extant animals in the world. Orcas are super smart and social creatures. variety of communicative sounds and each pod has distinctive noises that its members can recognize even at a distance. Rather than for communicating, orcas use echolocations for hunting too. Orcas can be found from polar regions to the equator. Their diet includes fishes to marine birds and animals including the whales. While dealing with the marine birds, the orca squeeze out its bulk from its feathers and outfits. In case of hunting whales, what they don't make up with their size comparatively is all compensated with their numbers. Orcas hunt in deadly pods which can even include 40 family members. Being air breathing mammal and spending majority of the life in the water, they are having no sense of smell actually. But what they lack with their smelling sense is all compensated with their excellent eyesight and hearing. The gestation period of an orca is 17 months to deliver a baby which can weigh up to 300 pounds and the nursing period could last up to two years. After delivery, the moms are much caring towards their juveniles and even the female teens assist the mom in nursing the juveniles. They are having no natural predators except the most brutal species, us. These creatures are hunted down and brought to captivity to play cheap tricks for entertaining few stupid people. I'm Jamie. Welcome to Shamu Stadium! Activity, we see stereotypic behaviours and these are abnormal repetitive behaviours that have no outwardly obvious function. So for example, staring at a concrete wall. That's so insane. I mean I used to be in this pool swimming with these whales and you see then that head bump. That head bump is a precursor to nursing, yes. which can't nurse in that position. So I can imagine like a crying baby needing the, something from the mother and the mother so depressed, she incapable of taking care of her calf. And that's what you're seeing here. We just need better education. Because you know, most people, they're not malicious. Most people, when, they, when right. they see these animals and you explain it to them and you show them these behaviors and you say, do you think that an animal lying at the bottom of the tank, staring at the wall is good for it? It's just such a toxic place. Yes, you guys head up. And actually, we're going to ask you guys to leave property. And why is that? Uh, uh, my supervisor will speak with you at the front. Orcas in captivity often know what iron bars and concrete from stress, anxiety, and boredom. Sometimes breaking their teeth and resulting in painful dental drilling without anesthesia. Today, while I'm talking about orcas, almost 60 orcas are living in captivity. Please stay away from these cruel stupidities. Also, the countries shown in the screen allows whale hunting presently. Each year, 16,000 orcas are murdered throughout the world. While in case of other countries, even though they don't make it out directly, overfishing is another reason for threatening of these creatures. So let's fight together against these cruelties. If you like my video, please subscribe to my channel, leave down a thumbs up and let me know your suggestions for my next video. Thank you, I'll be soon in front of you with another video. to show them face to face that we are scared of a big company, yet alone a child is.